Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today we're going to be playing some more Dragon Blade. Now, uh, I did just get Tenuvia to Ultra, so now I'm working on Rolo or Rulo, whichever how you pronounce her name. She's at 4 right now, so once I DFI her and get her to Ultra again, then I'll be pretty much set for my Dark Soul key. So, the dream is almost there. You're almost there, but I did get a lot of stuff from like uh, events and everything. So I'm gonna open those. I didn't really get far. But I did manage to uh, get my Mage Awakened, finally. It took quite a while, but it's done. Got everything out of there, and now we're gonna go do Hydra. Uh, yeah, let's just let's just roll with that team. They have been adding in um, new. Okay, I I forgot about that. I didn't change my um, affirmation again. How do I keep forgetting that? But they have a lot of things that have been added in this week, which I'll show you guys. Right afterwards. Wait, who did she summon? She sucked at this and what else? Oh, it's the samurai guy. Or did she just summon that? I have no idea. I'm just waiting for the one shot. Because I know it's going to come really soon. But so we're getting up there. Come on. Come on, guys. Almost to 40 mil. Oh no, they're in rage. All right, we got a, we got the forty mil, at least. Nubia is doing so much damage right now. That's the only reason I'm making it this far. Oh, my archer could be dead. And Bell could be dead. Well, Bell was dead. Then somebody brought her back to life. I don't know who it was, but somebody brought her back to life. And now the dream is still alive. <laughs> this is the longest I've been inside of Hydra. So, getting Tanuvia to Ultra is pro probably was the best idea for this. I wonder how high you guys are gonna go. But we do have uh, a lot more shoes now. I used a little bit of uh, rubies on the shoes. So we should be good for now. Around like 500. We have quite a few units we can use as uh, food on the weekend. If I actually remember to log in on the weekend. 
I mean, I log in, I just don't get on the right time that the that the buff is going on. That the pants but ally buff is going on. Up. Oh. Probably could be stopped. Oh, no, Snubia wants to keep going. Nope, Stone Bear wants to keep going. He wants to keep the dream alive. Nope, I'm sorry, buddy, you can't. Literally, Snubia was all of my damage. She kept the dream alive. What place am I? Eh. Still pretty bad, but you know, I've got farther than I usually get. I'll give it that. So I just got my rubies from those. And I did a little bit of Buster Tower. And Jesus Christ. I got to floor 20 right now on my mage. Since I can't really do it here, since they're blocking me off from it. But we'll get there later. I have been doing like Guild Wars in it lately, and they've actually been pretty fun. Let's just do one now so we can die miserably. And we do now have another person in my guild. Thank you, Dan. Alright, let's get started. I'm pretty sure me and Dan are gonna die, then Patch is gonna die, then Death is gonna die. Unless Death can turn invisible and clutch up. It always takes a while to search for an actual match for some reason. Most of the time, people come in here without skills. Especially if they have a key already. Yeah, I kind of thought so. But we got XP, so... That's all that matters in my eye. <laughs> I want to see, like, the ranking rewards. So, pretty much, we're in the 20%. Uh, what does this mean? I'm so confused. Okay, member ranking. So, for the whole guild, do they get like 960 rubies? To everyone, I believe? I have no idea. Somebody please explain that to me. And I also am maxing out uh, her skills right now. To Nubia skills. Uh, I might be maxing out her uh, third ability, unless anybody has a different say about it. But, hold on. I gotta check and make sure I don't have any, like, speed. Nope, that's not it. That's not speed. Apparently I don't have any, like, speed card. Yeah, so apparently I don't have any speed cards. Hmm. Trying to change out, uh, Tanubia's card, which is accuracy. Not sure if that's gonna be good on her. But, let's continue on with our adventure, because it's been a long time since we actually gotten through here. So, I'm actually going to be streaming tonight, and it's going to be Amnesia, which I, like I said, it's going to be a long night, but like always, I start up my streams at 7pm, or around 7pm at least, Eastern Time, and this should be fun. You guys can come by, laugh at me, or, you know, help out. Help out as much as you can. Alright, it seems like we just got the story. So, I'm gonna just let this play through.
still looking for a Tanuvia gift. Transparent. Just saying. Just looking for one. If anybody can do it, I would appreciate it. For multiple reasons. I gotta say, uh, there's a lot of, like, new things that I just forgot, I just remembered that I need to show afterwards. Alright. I think we still have a few more floors to go before we actually get back onto the actual story. Yeah, I'm Dark Fortress. Okay. So, pretty much what they added in this week. Whoops. Not linking. Or these two guys. Well, this guy and her. Everybody is saying that she is pretty OP for everything. And... I'm kind of thinking it's true, considering her skills. She is going to be quite the force to be reckoned with. So, I'm actually happy because I did get a paladin. And it's not the paladin that I wanted, but, you know, it's a paladin I could use as, you know, pretty much deify food. So, I could just deify her and get her light, but I'm going to wait until I actually get my... Dark Soul Key before I actually get her. I believe their shields are like stackable. Does it does it actually tell you? But still no new keys just yet, except for these these guys. But they've been there for quite a while now. They also added in a new event, these little pig uh, events. So consume battle points and consume uh, venture points. And these dungeons give these rewards. So you can easily farm inside this event if you guys want to. So I'll probably have a better chance getting it through like the battle. Because I have a crap ton of like battle tickets. Well raid tickets. Which is going to be quite consuming. I have managed to keep up my schedule, but I can't like show it for some reason. And this is still going on, I believe. Yeah, this is still going on. It only pops up the next 11 hours. I believe that's a permanent thing, but you can also get here by clicking that. But I'm not sure how you would get to the other one. I guess you would go to a fight? Yeah, you would go to fight and then you can get to that one. But let's continue on. You got more story to complete. I gotta say, Buster uh, Tower without keys is actually pretty challenging. But the fact that I made it to floor 20 without a key is actually pretty entertaining. Just pretty much for the whole hour or two, me, Xandra, and Dan and Def have been talking inside a guild. You know, just raiding and just making a whole bunch of jokes. <laughs> God, it was fun. And until I actually tried to um, fight Death Crown again. And, you know, I almost killed him. I got him down to 5% health. But he then, out of nowhere, he said, fuck you, take insta kill. And it, it, it was pretty much over from there. I hate my life, to be honest. I was so close, like, so close, I could taste it, but then I got denied, like, so hard. And now I'm pretty triggered. That's, that's some BS, you know? It's just a taste destiny and have it ripped away from you. So, from now on, I did vow that I'm going to kill every Death Crown that I see. Even if it's in an arena or an adventure somewhere, I'm killing everyone. 
Death Crown has now become my kill on sight. Fuck you, Death Crown. But I gotta say, Guild War on my mage is like actually pretty fun because you never know the outcome of it. But then again, everyone has like 150 gear. And I was in Buster. We we won a few, lost a few. I think that was my fault because I don't have key. But you know, we're not gonna even talk about that. I've been like farming as much as I could for key, so cut me some slack. I I'm getting there, <laughs> but I gotta say I'm getting I'm getting pretty close from where for where I am. Then I'm gonna make a a giga key. Then I should be even more good. Who is that hiding behind you? Oh, okay, it's it's that guy, the assassin. Like he was literally hiding behind a uh, storm bear. Alright, how many more floors do we have? We have like, okay, yeah, we have one more. Then we're back on more story. Let's go ahead and do it. Fuck you, I'm not bringing you anywhere into my party. Go ahead and take out those guys. To be honest, I just woke up and I'm literally trying to find topics to talk about. My brain is not complete right now, guys. <laughs> Snowbell and King Graham are getting their transcendence next for the Korean version. And you guys can actually YouTube that. Or I can put up a picture right here because they actually look pretty thick. I'm I especially love uh, King Graham because he looks like really dope. Especially with the black hair. So Noah's gonna judge him that he has like the most creepiest lance ever. Pretty sure heroes don't have creepy swords like that. Or creepy weapons in general. Except for a few in anime, so I can't really say anything about that. I mean Got either. I mean, let's be honest. Pretty weird weapons. Okay. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Go ahead, kill him, please.
I'm pretty sure uh, around here is, I think that smack had killed his daughter, is what I think it is. Yep, yep, I was right. He smacked the taste out of her mouth so hard she just insta died for some odd reason. You wouldn't think that would work, but it it worked. Hey, are you okay? No, we we murdered him. I, I'm pretty sure we murdered him. Oh, we actually have six shoes. I did not notice that. Getting back into the safe zone. The safe zone is at least 800 or 1,000. Don't worry, I can stop them easily. Oh yeah, I'm almost done with... No, I can't say I'm almost done. I'm still on Chapter 3, finishing up uh, Myth. But it's actually pretty easy now that my mage is uh, awakened. Then I'm going to move on to Chapter 4, at least as much as I can, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it's going to take quite a while. Oh yeah, I didn't even look at the other guy's skill. It's reset to, it's reset to ma- oh my god. Uh, um, sir, I don't know if you know this, but... That's, that's ridiculous. That's just retardedly OP. Just to keep resetting somebody's skills on your basics. Decrease their defense by 50%. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. Enemy cannot use skills for 9 seconds. Okay, yep, you're retardedly OP. Taunt all enemies, decrease damage by 70%. Cast a buff to all allies to reduce damage by 16%. Okay, yep. I kind of want you now. But I have no warrior kit. Well, I did have a warrior. But I had to use him as food for Tanuvia. It was all worth it. I, I have no problem with it. Decrease the, da the crit damage by 200%. And just pretty much increase your H the party's HP by 21 okay well I kind of want you now man that's gonna be <laughs> those two are gonna be like retardedly good it's bad enough that uh, what's her name actually resets skills and cooldowns all your active, well I believe inactive skills or active skills, whichever one, pretty much resets your skills. Then max out the um, enemy skills. But that guy hitting multiple things, I'm pretty sure pretty much it's going to be really annoying until you actually kill him. But considering he's like a really good tank, I'm not sure about that. Like the Gigas are actually outclassing most of the characters right now. I mean, technically they should, considering we are in Chapter 4. But Jesus, this is like a whole new level of outclassing. Except for Till. Or Tal. Whichever. How you pronounce her name. I cannot pronounce most of these names. 
takes me a while to get used to him, but nobody can outclass her stun rate just yet. Just her stunning on her basics. Pretty retarded. That's why she's still in the meta right now. When was it? Uh, 55? I don't have to worry about it. I'm gonna probably out level the place. But I did get some stuff. Participate in Arena and Fortress Battle. Pretty sure we could do two Fortress Battles, like sooner or later. Yeah, sooner or later. Then we gotta do this again later. I would prefer to do that with my mage and actually cause damage and kill things. But yeah, guys, we're gonna leave it right here and I hope you guys enjoyed. But uh, remember, I upload Dragon Blaze videos on Tuesday and Friday. And I'm going to try to keep that to that schedule as much as I can. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.